with Droyles them managing to claw back some places in the league, we're looking pretty hot right now. Now, I'm not saying that we're going to end up winning the league. But I'm just saying, looking pretty hot. Our form's looking pretty good. It's one of the best in the leagues. And <clears throat> in the league. And slowly but surely, we're going to start claiming those places. Our next victims, Dagenham and Redbridge. That's the victims because they're two different places in one team name. Let's Let's vanish and banish this team of dreadfulness and pick our actual superstars that are going to give us the plays that we need. Got a lot of yellow cards here, which I'm not liking about. David Scott managing to get yellow cards everywhere. Dodd has, has he almost got 10? How many has he got? Oh my goodness. <laughs> He's already almost got 10 yellow cards. Slimey. He's putting a shift in. 8.1 tackling. He's really trying. He's really trying. Uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, he doesn't actually uh, get red or something. I'm, I'm a bit worried. But we'll we'll manage. We'll come across that when, when it happens. I'm, you know, there's ways around it. There's ways around it. Don't worry about it. Um, okay. Yeah, yeah. That's our team. We understand our team now. Why is White the one? No, he's not. When he's that. Oh, sorry. It seems like my water has gone down the wrong way and it's causing minor problems for my breathing. <laughs> but don't worry, he will manage on. Sebastian Rios don't need breathing. Uh, he just needs tactical ingenuity. That's what he uses. Uh, and a lot of luck. <laughs> um, there we go. That's our... Featherston is knackered. How knackered is knackered, though? He is exhausted. Okay. Let's put Hammond in there. And Daly. Is everyone good? Everyone's good there. Everyone's good to go. That's a pretty slick looking side if I've ever seen one. Back on Redbridge. You're going down. Away from home. I don't know what our home and away record is. Actually, I'm going to quickly check. Um, how do you table uh, home record? Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my God. I never want to be at work playing at home ever again. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen it. Where we're so good away. Why are we so good away? What have we done? Oh, no. Oh, dear. Droylsden, the theatre of nightmares. That's what they call our stadium now. Dreadful area. Dreadful place. Let's just go on tour. Oh, okay. Right, we didn't. We managed to not concede a penalty. It looks like the Dagon and Raybridge are really running us over. They're not playing exceptional, though. N it seems like neither of us are playing well. We've both managed to be shite. Uh, I might take Dodd off. Dodd. Definitely take Dodd off. And I think that's it for now. Dodd for Hammond. Two tackles from six and barely any passes. I, I I want something else. Hammond usually gets the ball moving a little bit more. We'll see if that, that adds a little bit of pizzazz to us. Okay. Oh, um, sure, coming off. Maybe, wait. No, it's got, it's got to be Smith. And... That'll probably be it, actually. That'll probably, probably be it. I can't talk this episode. Sorry. <laughs> this is, this is uh, the panic of seeing our away record so high and our home so low is, um, has caused some sort of anaphylactic shock, <laughs> I think. Oh, no. We are, we are really struggling this game. Let's just replace our striker, see if we get some fresh legs up the, up the top of the pitch. Get one goal in. There we go! Sure, managing a heroic, heroic goal. I'm one of the most mediocre games we've ever played, but that is important. We need those type type of wins. Another another win, and we end up second. Just remember that another win, and we end up second. The back four did exceptional that game. Absolutely exceptional. Really pleased with that game. Good job, everyone. I don't know why the game's taking so long to process. Uh oh.
Uh oh, don't crash after that. That was quite a heroic victory. Sure, the two two finishing, three finishing hero. He tries to shoot so many times and it never goes in. But that time, that time Ah the there's something there was something in the stars that just said it's gonna be a goal. Jamie Marsh has already one point two million. <laughs> one point six million, sorry. Why? He's got five goals in ten games. That seems a bit like it's um that seems like an overestimation, but I'm not gonna complain. Uh okay. Warren Smith is shattered, so he's not even gonna get on the bench. Warren James is knackered, so Featherston's gonna be the replacement there. Uh Shaw and Farley are both also done in. So Shaw I, I wanna say, yeah, he's done in. That uh, probably Stein is the Selection there, and we'll have Shaw on the bench. I think he probably can do about 30 minutes. Uh, and Farley is exhausted, and David Scott's going to be the replacement there. And Broadhurst it comes in on the bench. That's a decent, de decent squad there. That's decent. Um, Flynn's still injured, still unhappy. Uh, hates everything about me, hates my guts, but he's going to Walsall. <laughs> Why you go to Warsaw, pal? Of all the places you go, oh, I dream big. I could go to any club in the world. I'm gonna go to Warsaw. <laughs> this is not. That's not right, pal. Okay, they're lower than us in the league. You should not be doing this. But you know, you do you. You do you. Uh, I'm happy with that. Away from home. <laughs> we we're terrifying. We're we're on tour. We we know. We we live for the coach ride. So Fulham, you better watch out. The further the distance we better the better we play. And you're from London, we're from Manchester, we gonna dominate. <laughs> what is happening? What is this season? I don't want this to be the winning season. <laughs> I don't feel like we deserve it. I, I, but we, we're managing, after that horrific start to the season, we're now getting shots on target, partially um, in in fairness to Jamie Marsh getting, getting a few games, that was. And there have been a few changes that have been important. It just feels wrong, though. Featherson's not playing well. And... Um, any, anyone injured? Jamie Marsh is injured, so let's keep him safe. And there we go. Okay, can we can we manage to eke out a goal? Oh, okay. Fulham is trying to bite back. They're trying to bite back. Dodd getting a warning. Are we able to eke out a victory again in the final closing moments, or will Fulham be able to do it? Oh, oh my goodness! There's so much happening in the final few minutes. Oh, Fulham are going for it. Oh no, no! <laughs> Oh, Fulham. They really d did try and try and try again. They deserved that victory. Dodd getting an absolute killer performance in, though. And Scott getting a killer performance in. Well done, my friend. Thing is, we are a, like half a squad without um, Marsh. Not Marsh. Smith. Walter Smith. Uh... It's just, it is so important. I'm just going to pause because genuinely, this water has fucked me up. And from H2O to H2O, no, I'm back. <laughs> I can get a team from the conference to Europe without, you know, needing any sort of, you know, just, just, just the youth players. But I can't drink Walker and Walker drink. <laughs> Drink water and not suffer. Fucking hell, it's gotten to my head. I swear it's water and not gin. Like I, I'm not taking shots while I'm I'm playing games. Although <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. Um, let's let's just reselect because there's a few changes here. Dawes Hargreaves, uh, Flynn, 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 Flynn. Yeah, Flynn. Uh, Flynn Gray, uh, Dodd. And then let's get the power couple of Farley and James. James or Featherston? James or Featherston? It's a constant conundrum. I think James for the time being. 
I think they're both just as good as each other. They're, they're kind of unexceptional, but I, I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Oh. So, um, because we have the same. No. Featherston has a bit more creativity. I think, Feather... yeah, let's go with it. Let's go with Featherston. Give him a shot. Um, on the left, you know who. On the right, you know who. And up front, you know you. You know you. I more my English has really suffered this episode. I apologize. Uh, Broadhurst James and uh, probably uh, Daily. And everyone's fit. Everyone's raring to go. We're at home. The theater of nightmares. The butcher's arms ground. Maybe it's all the, the horrible comments I said about the stadium. Towards the start of the season, I said that, why is it called a ground? It's not a stadium. It's just a piece of dirt. And now look, we, 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 our form is plummeted at home. And we just can't please our own home fans. So maybe it's on me. Maybe it is on me. And I, I sincerely apologize. Maybe we can turn it around. Uh, maybe we should rename the stadium. So it's a stadium. Maybe we should rename it <laughs> instead of it being a ground. Um, and it sounds like it's a ground owned by a pub. <laughs> so maybe it should be improved. But hopefully we can overcome that in this very boring nil-nil. Uh, it seems like no opportunities are going to be on either side. But there we go. 20 yards out. Mr. Warren Smith. I don't know how he does that. <laughs> I, think, I guess it's another free kick. But blimey. It's uh, it's quite a whirlwind when he does that out of nowhere. Uh, Featherstone's not doing too hot in terms of injury, and Farley's also not doing too good either. So a lot of people tired, even though there's not a lot happening in this match. Seems like we're getting a lot of possession, but we're not doing a lot with it. Which is okay if we can just eke out this nil-nil. There's one nil even, and one more for the road? No, not one more for the road. That's fine. Dodd man of the match. What a, what a hero. But Warren Smith, did he get injured there? No, he just ended up with 62 because he was passing a lot. Okay. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. We're sort of tying it up almost. Um, I thought I wasn't recording then. That would have been a nightmare. Um, <laughs> not that this was the most exceptional game ever. But, you know. But yeah, I... Uh, I fingers crossed. Now we're getting close to that second place. How's first place doing? They're nah, doing all right. We we're, we're keeping up with them though. Um, they're still in the FA Cup. The issue is they can't really get that many injuries. They have got one guy with a broken leg, but actually, I kind of pref <laughs> I kind of would prefer them to play these players because if this guy, for example, is replacing him, he's world class. This bloke ain't world class, so it's a bit of a tricky conundrum. Uh, we shall see. We shall see. Uh, another Premier League match. I think we're all going to be knackered. We are going to be knackered. This is... Um, we're getting congestion already this season. Um, uh, Doors and Hargreaves are tired, so... Harrison? Um, Harrison and... Andrews? I think. Is a decent pairing. I don't think it's a pairing we've ever done before, but we can give it a go. On the left, uh, Flynn is knackered, so naturally. Julian Parker in already. Uh, Keith Clark getting the nod as well. CMC. Um, well, James is going to be the only one who's fit, I believe. Yeah, James. I don't think he's played at DMC before. We'll see what happens there. Hammond is fit, but, you know, Hammond is... The worst of the bunch, but he's good to have just in case. Uh, Broadhurst and Scott being the twosome that we're going to pick in the middle. Uh, on the left, oh, Walker's injured for two weeks. That's no good, is it? That's not good at all. He just started dribbling, for God's sake. <laughs> Can't have that. He just realized he's got two feet. Uh, it's an important time for him to capitalize on that. And we're going to have Mr. Danny White up front because... Uh, we're lacking a lot of creativity in this team. Maybe it's it's good for him to be up there. We'll have um, Chapman on the bench. Uh, oh God, I'm really suffering for voices of forward attacking players to have on the bench. So I think we're going to have to bring in Mackin or Palmer. Um, 
We'll bring in. We'll cook. Oh, they're all really bad, aren't they? <laughs> they're all really bad. Oh dear. I'll pick armor. Put Roland on there as well. Uh, Hammond and Daily. Decent. So Roland is knackered though. So it looks like it's going to be a cook or May. May is going to be on the bench. Rare occasion for him. See what we can do. Uh, I'm really glad the water has subsided and QPR at home. And can we get a goal at home? And it looks like we're we're doing pretty well actually. For a, a half baked team, and there we go. David Scott, first goal of the season. He's getting a few last season, and he's going to carry that on this season. I'm not expecting goals from him, but obviously it's good for him to pitch in once in a while. I'll get the important goals. But Taylor, I didn't to get a reply out. Only scored eight goals this season from 30 games. We really shouldn't be conceding to players like that. We've got a rock solid defense after all. Uh, it looks like we're actually suffering a little bit, but I would like us to get two goals in a game for the first one the first times this season. It's very rare for us to do it. Oh, a yellow card to one of our players. Oh, there's a lot of yellow cards, in fact. Warren James is doing awfully in terms of fitness. And Danny White is. Danny White, Danny, what's he been doing? My God, he's a passing machine. I don't really need you to do that. I want you to score goals. <laughs> really. Um, I might keep him on, though. Uh, no, I won't. No, I won't. Chapman, and then let's take off. Oh, Broadhurst with the passing. Brilliant. Actually, no, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Oh, certain to score. Why didn't he score? Why didn't he score as well? Come on. Come on. No! <laughs> no! What the hell happened in the last few minutes? Taylor just skinned us alive! Who is this kid? He's not even a kid. He's older than my whole team. Oh, no. Game of his life. Game of his life. Wow, okay. Disappointing. Disappointing that home record still. A huge factor in our losses. I don't understand. <laughs> I've never had that before. Uh, an away game for us to froth our mouths at. And uh, yeah, food reserves. Let's get the let's get these kids going with their very excited, uh, excitable matches. Um, let's. Who's on the left? Uh, Downey, Robinson, um, who's DMC? Pedersen? No, not Pedersen. Hammond. Hammond, you can be. There we go. Hammond, uh, May, and uh, I don't know who else. Who else? Roland, are you fit? You are fit. Good. May and Roland. On the left, we have. Oh, you know, Palmer on the right, we have Stein. Uh, and up front, we have the man, the myth, the legend. Uh, uh, I, I might play Phil Scott. I might play Phil Scott up front. Let's do it! Let's go! And it doesn't matter who's in the bench, as long as they're not first, first team starters. Uh, yeah, I'm happy with that. Let's go. Let's go. I want this man, I want Phil Scott to just to score a hat trick. That's my dream right now. Come on, Phil Scott. He's got a header. He got a header. Can he do it? Can he do it? He's such a wildly uh just unbalanced player. Palmer score. Didn't mean it. That's alright. <laughs> You're sort of our shining beacon of hope for the future in that centre of midfield. Um so keep scoring those accidental goals. Chapman. We're not, we're not, we just, I, actually, well, we're, we're, we're I, I shouldn't celebrate that we're, we're doing quite well against these, because they're, like, low, low in the third division, they're not even high in the third division, like, look at their star player, these are decent, uh, look at their other star player, oh, he's actually a creative powerhouse, oh, great, um, look at their other, fuck me, these lower divisions are really good players at the moment, 
Blimey. Where'd they get the money? Oh. Please make sure we actually uh, see this one out. Uh, Jim Hammond, he has potential foot injury. We're gonna have to play Danny Parker. Let's go. That's a that's a name you haven't seen for a while. Um, admittedly, I probably shouldn't have put Horner on the bench. Not that he matters too much. I'll probably play Ma Mackin in DMC for Roland. And let's see what we can do there. Again, another another risky one. Let's see if Mackin suits that DMC role. Well, he got a key pass. He got a shot on target. Maybe that's his his armor getting another goal. He didn't mean the first one. I think he meant the second one. That's a good game from us. Let's go. All right, we're in the FA Cup fourth round against Blackpool. And yeah, I'm gonna end the episode there. What a weird episode that was. We're gonna be in the FA Cup actually. In the next episode against Blackpool, ain't that excited? Get the cat excited. That's what we say here. Get the cat excited. By the way, that's copyright Adam Pacitti. Don't, don't. That's not, that's not my thing. Watch Cultaholic. They're great. Catch you later.